Buh. It's me! For real, for real. Can you believe it? We're back in Halo Reach after all this time. Now, uh, some people were saying that there was a stream that happened just before this was some messed up audio. Don't believe them. Um, I'm a professional, and mistakes like that don't happen. So, yeah, just uh, don't believe <clears throat> the haters. Fuck them. Frick them. Oh, we're only two and a half minutes in, man. They're going to dock me points on that. Oh. But uh, welcome. The Infinity looks beautiful behind you, doesn't it? What a beautiful ship that is. I don't know why. I can only turn like 45 degrees. I need a better animation for my Halo Reach chair. I actually just need my Halo Reach chair to work in general. It kind of sucks. I need my space couch. I already made you a regular couch with gauss cannons. Why do you want a space couch? No. I got you your couch. You have the couch. I've started multiple streams in it because it's very comfortable and I like it a lot. Professional. Listen, technically speaking, if you make money doing anything, you are a professional in it. So, I am technically a professional Halo modder, thank you. Or, well, I'm a professional streamer. I just happen to Halo mod while doing it. If you want to be specific, nobody has actually commissioned me for a mod yet. Yet! Three cushion space couch? I bet Reach actually does have a better couch model. Somewhere, like somewhere. Did I just see Reach in the description? You did, in fact, Luke. You did. Why the return? Because Halo 3 was falling off, dude. Nobody wanted to see Halo 3, and I was getting kind of bored with Halo 3. Like, I do want to go work on that Scarab mod more, just because scary giant city explosion death destruction is very fun, but also Halo Reach is kind of where it's at. TBH. TBH Honest. So, uh, let's see. R <laughs> RS strapping engines onto that chair specifically for the space mod would be hilarious. Yeah. Wheezy in the chat, Anvil Maker himself. What? What does that mean? What are you talking about? You abandoned it? Wrong. Actually, I was just on Extinction earlier. You guys want to go on a field trip to Extinction? You just want to go... Get on You... You got to... Wait, Wheezy, I, I... You... I recognize that name from like a little while ago. We're going to Extinction. Whoa! Yeah, baby! Okay, I'm gonna turn on my webcam, but I have to warn you. I'm scary today. Brush you off the proper condor. I think I will, actually. Oh, wait, my, my webcam's a little bit messed up. Hold on. We're gonna first... We're gonna, we're gonna go like this. Uh, and now... Where is it? Where is it? Weasel, did you steal it? Much better. Now I don't have to try to hide the fact that I just got out of the shower. Easy. Simple, really. Mew check. Was that your ass hitting the chair? Yeah. It, every time I sit down on my chair, it goes. <laughs> as my cheeks like slowly clap together and the jiggle finally stops. Just every single time it's just. New RJ haircut? I just put a beanie on it. I, I haven't gotten a haircut in a minute. I'm gonna be honest, I, I do need one. <laughs> Holy shit, you alert the guards. Colonel, I'm trying to sneak around. The clap of my ass cheeks keeps alerting the guards. <laughs> Yo, Joe, thank you for the $2 tip, man. I appreciate it. Thank you very much. When I think of Reach Extinction, I just go at the thought of the Reach Condor. It's just so good. There's also the Halo 3 Hornet, but nobody cares about that shit. It's actually Joe the Assassin, you fake Halo fan, you fake fan, you fake Extinction Enjoyer, it's actually the Halo 2 Anniversary Multiplayer Hornet. Oh, oh, the game you're always talking about. Oh, that's a rough one there, buddy. You're not going to recover from that shit. 
even worse. Yeah, okay, you're so funny. Oh, right, I forgot, guys. Oh, let me turn the volume up. Uh, <laughs> you guys can't even hear the game. Totally forgot, because uh, I was messing with a bunch of Skaboodly's tags, I have the Skaboodly era assault rifle here. Joe <laughs> on life support. The Hornet is unbelievably good, that's why we can't use it. It's too good, true. Actually, as far as the Hornet is concerned, I do need to fix some of its animations. It's a little buggy, a little busted. Best vehicle in extinction is the Space Banshee? True. Going through the tunnels in the Space Banshee is wonderful. Why, is, uh, why isn't this an H2A multiplier, which is a better engine? Because nobody gives a fuck about H2A. People played Halo Reach and they were like, I want to play mods for the cool game that I liked playing growing up. Dude, nobody grew up on Halo 2 Anniversary multiplayer. I'm just gonna, I'm sorry. How's your wife doing? Uh, she's great. She should be somewhere around here. Let's see if we can't find her. Honey, are you here? She's not here, actually. Unfortunate. I have to teleport my wife in. Wait, that's not her. That's not my wife. Honey, where are you? Oh, there she is. Guys, calm down. Calm down, she's here. She's here, guys. Calm down. She's here. Halo 4 Cortana, I mean my wife, is here. God damn, she just built different. Holy fuck, god damn! That's crazy. Uh, oh yeah, there's Godzilla. He's also here. He's kinda looking beastly, man. I'll be honest. Bro is big, chillin'. Your wife? She's mine now? Haha, <laughs> die. I just realized that you've uh, been able to make a kaiju-sized Cortana all this time. Have one of those stomping through the city. That is some fetishy shit, Anthony. I'm gonna be so real with you. That is definitely on some fetishy stuff. On some fetishy energy. Like, you saying that is very, like, um... I'm the ass man. Hey, I, I, put, I put respect on your name for that, you know? Godzilla's looking scary. Godzilla's the guy your wife tells you not to worry about? Hey, I can't disagree with that. I left the music really loud. It's better. Extinction do be looking pretty nice, I will say. I kind of want to do a playtest really soon of this, to be honest. I made quite a few changes to the geometry of the map since the last uh, Extinction playtest. I don't think we had any of, like, this new terrain. Like, it was pretty different. Did No, we had this, actually. What am I saying? We did have this. More Space Banshee content? Fine. Fine. I'll add the Space Banshee content, okay? Fine. Yuki, thank you for the 15 months. Much appreciated. Thank you, thank you, thank you for your support. So, yo, been moving houses. I've been gone for a bit. Well, I hope your move went well. It's good to see you. It's even better to see me. No, I hope it went well, though. That's cool. Latency is great today. What the heck? Yeah. That was literally instant. It's always instant. You're just never live. It's always been an illusion. Woo! Space Banshee con- Dude, this is still as satisfying as it has ever been. The message is being read by you so fast? Yeah, I'm just on the ball. What can I say? Alright. Extinction is gonna come to life. We're gonna bring it to life. I want to clean things up, and uh, I want to make this mod... Dude, I know I said I was going to do space combat, and and we are going to do space combat, but I don't know, man. Extinction fucking... It slaps titties, dude. This mod actually slaps large, enormous titties. I don't think there's so much map. It would be worth it if there's a more convenient way to tell people where people are needed. Oh, God, Joshua. Are you about to start talking about the blue force thingy? Is that, is that where you're gonna, you know that's not possible, right? You're aware that for the 50,000th time I have to tell you that it can't be done. You are aware of that, are you not? Bring microtransactions to MCC. Please, spam it. Let the people know. Paw Patrol has one? What is your point? That's a TV show. What does a TV show have to do with Halo Reach? <laughs> not Agent Yuki VR, definitely not Agent Yuki VR, has tipped two dollars. Thank you very much. Let's see how fast this is. I wonder. Literally instantly? Hell yeah. I mean, delay usually gets worse over time as my ISP just randomly decides to throttle internet connections because they're assholes. 
We'll see, though. Yo, Joe, thank you for the $2 tip. Appreciate it, man. Thank you. Not gonna lie, you moved from Onyx... <laughs> you moved from Extinction so long ago. Have you ever nerfed the shit out of the Mac cannon on the Condor? After uh, all, that shit just destroyed the Cubby side. Same with the Mammoth? Nope. Not yet. I think after that playtest, I kind of went to the space mod and then back to Halo 3. So we got a lot to do on this mod. A lot, a lot to do. Why is there an upside down man? Did it? Okay. I need to clean this all up. This is getting, it's getting a little, it's getting a little crazy out here. There's just stuff everywhere. They're literally just all, all over the place. Why is all this down here even? Go away. Those can stay. Those actually, I think, are good spawns. These are fine. There's something over here. I don't know what. Oh, dude, I totally forgot. Guys, I was making big changes to Extinction and never imported them into the map. This map has some major adjustments made to it. I completely forgot about them. I will say the Extinction mod is more hype, but you should definitely work on the Space Battles mod first. Says you. I'm gonna disagree wholeheartedly and say, I think I'm gonna, I'm probably just gonna do Extinction today, man. I'll be honest, just seeing this mod has made me all of a sudden go, I'm going a little bit. I'm, I'm, I'm gut up. Dude, look at this. I forgot about this. The interior of the, of this area, I was working on these funny little shield shape things. That's pretty cool. Agent Yuki, VR, not you though, tipped six dollars. Thank you very much. I really appreciate it. Thank you, thank you. Rejected, give me a halo weapon I should make in Roblox when I return properly. A Spartan laser. Thank you. Important information. I'm watching this while on the toilet. I'm pooping. Now that's badass. That is fucking badass. That is so sick. Let's go. Yes. Anyway. Uh, I was working on a little area over here. I was going to turn this into like a Blood Gulch style thing. Do you guys recall, do any of you, or any of you from the original Halo Reach uh, Extinction era many months ago, many moons ago, you might recall that I had an idea of like spawn points that started closer, that progressively moved backwards. Wait, guys, I also forgot. There's another thing that wasn't in the playtest. The weapons. The weapons. The Spartan. Okay, well, the Spartan laser was already on the map. Um, oh, man. I did a terrible job with the nuke launcher, didn't I? Hold up. Where's my nuke launcher? Do you guys remember I tried to make a nuke launcher and it was ass? That's called invasion. It sure is. Look at my ass tier nuke launcher. Garbage. What the fuck? Why did I make this so bad? Bruh. That's just awful. The weakest, saddest nuke of all time. Why isn't Extinction just a large invasion map? I think that's what I'm going to make it into, to be honest. Worst nuke. Just honestly so ugly. We're just going to pretend that that weapon just didn't exist. And uh, instead... Oh, we have this, though. Not this. We have this. I forgot about this. I think. Does it work? I don't think it works. I mean, it, it kind of sort of worked as a, what was it, a scenery object? You guys know what I'm talking about, right? <laughs> Yo, Joe, thanks for the $2 tip. Much appreciated, man. Thank you. Uh, is the cubby wall still missing collision for projectiles? I remember the condor just spawned camping through the walls. Dude, I don't know. Why are you, <laughs> maybe. I don't fucking... I don't know. I haven't worked on this mod in forever. Uh, oh, you mean those things. Oh, yeah, definitely. Dude, I've... Anything that was a bug in the version you played is still a bug now. I did not continue working on this. We're just now returning. You just said you had major map changes. And Blender, I haven't, I haven't fixed anything. That's why I asked. Ask this, dick. Oh, no wonder <laughs> they're not even set as instance geo. These need to be instance geo pieces. What is what? Rejected shotgun VR, except back. Actually, that's rejected shotgun RV. For the record. So, I don't know if it is typing backwards again, but thank you for the $2 tip. He said, erm, it's typing backwards again. 
Uh, I don't believe you, actually. Proof? I'm gonna need you to show me some proof, because I don't freaking believe you. Wouldn't be hard to set up if the biped's right to the map's uh, MODL and whatnot. Uh, custom invasion game type where you can spawn as other covenant. Yeah, yeah, actually, it, it's not hard at all to do in the same way that old Reach mods used to let you spawn in as monitors in like custom games and stuff because they were loaded into the MODL. You can absolutely do the same thing here, uh, which I really want to do, by the way. Uh, it sounds like a lot of fun. Now, let me think, let me think. There's a lot of things in this map needs. Um, I'm actually okay with these hangers being the way that they are for now. It's not a big deal. I know Skaboodly put a lot of effort into making way more detailed hangers, but I'm at this point not sure if the map can even handle the hangers that Skaboodly made. I think Reach's engine is just incapable of doing that. So for the, for now, this is okay. Um, and I, I've decided something, all right? I've decided something very simple. Guys, I am not a god tier 3D modeler. So here's the deal. I'm just going to lay it all out. I am not going to make a god tier, high, super high quality covenant base. I'm just going to make a pretty okay covenant base because the truth is I'm just really mediocre at 3D modeling. Okay, so I'm not going to cook super hard. I'm not going to make it the most beautiful thing ever. I just, I'm, I can't. That's, I'm not good at that. Improve your abilities. Improve this deck, man. I, I'm just going to do it. I'm going to do what I can, you know? I'm a, I'm a technical guy. I'm not an artist guy, you know what I'm saying? cook better you can do it i just don't want to put all that time into it because the amount of time it takes to bring things up to reach standards is way too long and i'm not going to do that okay just full stop nothing you can say will convince me otherwise don't even try i'm not going to put in all that effort i i refuse whole uh, just fully so instead i'm going to make a decent covenant base here it's sad you couldn't get the spire on the map i know i know it is very sad well i mean we did get the spire on the map but it was like Cursed. You gonna work an extinction first in the space battle and ultimate forge? I, I don't know. I haven't. I'm not gonna do it in any particular order. I'm just gonna do whatever I feel like. And and if you guys are enjoying watching it, obviously that'll motivate me to do it a lot more. And it seems like you guys are enjoying a, you know extinction because it's been a while. So I'll, I'll happily do this. Um, it's, it, it has been a while, and I'm, I'm really excited to get this working pretty nicely. Yo, Dark Steel, thank you very much for the fiber. He said, "Hot take: Huge maps, type and scale of huge maps don't work." And smaller scale maps and campaign maps are far better for mods due to Halo Engine BS. Um, I'm not really sure what you mean when you say Halo Engine BS. We can like donos. Yeah, I think it's a new feature. It's pretty cool. Yeah, unfortunately, I don't know what you're talking about. You say because of Halo Engine BS. That is very vague. I will say they work better. They function <laughs> gameplay-wise better for sure. Agent rejected shotgun VR in the way. You said, help, it's typing backwards. I can't stoop it. Can't even type correctly backwards. My God, what is going on? No, thank you very much for the two. I appreciate it. All right, I think. Should we finish up the cubby base? Just like close it off, you know? I was too scared for a long time to like finish off and close the cubby base, but I'd like to get a play test rolling soon. So I suppose I could just do like this, you know? Just get a little bit of... A little bit of map stuff in here. Go like that. Triangulate. That's fine. Dude, uh, let's make sure that the faces... Yeah, the faces are good. Okay, cool. Do a little bit of that. Look at that. We're just making... We're making it go. Surely play test tomorrow. Yeah, totally. Yeah, no, absolutely. Definitely 100%. Yeah, definitely. Totally. For surely. <clears throat> I think these need to be three-dimensional, right? Yeah, why are these two-dimensional? I just thought of a really easy way to make them three-dimensional. Uh, I'm gonna knife tool up to here. And I'm gonna knife tool up to here. And then I'm gonna give, what, what values is, that's the Y, so I need X and Z. So I'm gonna take the X. And the Z. And now they're even, then I can knife across like so. Delete this face here. <laughs> and hey, Earth's Cats tipped $2.18. Thank you so much. Wait, 18 cents, why? Heh, <laughs> typical ruin. You know what, honestly, streaming has been so non-lucrative financially lately. 
um, that even I will take an, an uneven dono right now. That's how that's how rough it's been. As much as like that triggers me, I'm not even mad, honestly. I mean, I'm a little, but I'm not going to talk about it because it's just wrong to be mad about something like that, you know? Please tell me that these are mirrored. What is wrong with me, dude? Why don't I mirror things? What the fuck is wrong with me? This is such an easily mirrored object that I'm just like, here we go, actually. Oh, no, I know why. It's because it's trying to fit into the... Yeah, never mind. Because you never upload? I know. I'm working on it. You know what I'm doing after this continuing work on the video? I don't know if you guys will like... Like, you guys as stream watchers, you know? The nerds, basically. I don't know if you guys are going to enjoy the video I'm working on too, super, super hard. I hope you do, but the truth is, it is all stuff you've definitely seen before. So it's mostly for the, the audience that does not watch the streams. <laughs> Whoa, god damn! Backwards VR tip to twenty dollars and one cent. Thank you so much, actually, for that really, really big tip. I appreciate that a lot. Thank you so much. Here, don't spend it all at once. Hope it helps. It does, and thank you. I really appreciate that. I will spend it all at once. Just kidding. No, but thank you. I do really appreciate that. Oh no. Oh, that was a close one. Okay, hide that. Hide that? No, don't hide that. Hide that. Hide that. Okay, yeah, this is gonna be an issue. This is all flipped backwards. Why was this all flipped backwards, actually? Even this was flipped backwards. What the hell? Alright, there we go. Now we've got three dimensional exit ways and for some reason we just have floating edges here which I'm gonna kill them all right now let's add a roof Streamlabs spams emails for every dono wait what was that in relation to they keep getting email notifications with your full name yeah be like that It do be like that. Subdivide, woo! All right, here's how this is gonna work. I'm talking out loud, try to ignore me. <laughs> Go there to there. Holy shit! <laughs> Wait, thank you. What the fuck, demon? With the sixty dollars and one cent, really? With the one cent, you really just well, I, I can't be upset. Thank you very much for that extremely generous tip. Holy shit! Thank you very much. Thank you, thank you. I'm holding you. So stop biting me. I'm keeping you in my lap, cat. Thank you. Misleading thumbnail is misleading. I thought you were working on the destroyer. In full transparency, I actually was working on the destroyer. Or, well, I was going to work on the space mod, but then I opened up Extinction and I was just like, good, it's really cool, and then I got distracted because Extinction's a really cool mod. I, I have to just be honest here, I got really distracted. Show Cat. She's so weird, and she has Pika, so she just licks stuff, dude. <laughs> really nice pussy. Thanks. Let the cat cook. Even thank you though again and agent both y'all. Thank you very much for the support. Y'all are crazy for that. RV Strauch cab tipped two dollars and sixty seven cents. I wish I read it backwards. The dono backward is sixty seven dollars and two cents. Thank you very much. I appreciate it. I'm getting the cents and the tip goal to a greater number. Why are you like this? Who hurt you? 
It certainly couldn't have been me. 87 cents? To a great number, 10287. Supposed to be 69. You fucked it up! You fucked it up! Base? Why would I ever need to? There we go. Watch this. Watch it now. Look at those triangles. My god, Rejected is just so talented the way he moves those triangles around. Holy shit. He's an unstoppable force of triangular nature. Oh my god. The freaking Hank? You're so real for that. Hey. <laughs> RV struck cab tipped to two dollars thirteen cents. Yes! Thank you for evening the number out. I really appreciate it. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Darksteel, thank you for the $2 super chat, dude. Appreciate it. <laughs> what? What's, there's so much tip happening. Thank you very much, uh, Backwards VR, aka RV Strunk Cab, for the 269. Nice. Much appreciated. Bring this up to 107. 69. Nice. Thank you. Very nice. 87 plus 23 equals 100. If I'm wrong, prove it. No, you're... No, you're wrong. 87 plus 13 is 100. Good try, bucko. That's not math. You are totally wrong about that. Incorrect. I will say, though, that has always fucked me up, even as a kid. Also, side note, Darksteel, you have sent me a message. Read this message backwards. I'm scared. What is this? 8.123.812.982.526.352. What is that? What, is it? what are those numbers? Why did I read that out? Am I going to be like on a list now? Was that like the fucking coordinates to a buried body? What did you just make me read? I'm worried. <laughs> Your location. <laughs> Backwards VR. Thank you for the $2 tip. Much appreciated. The Daily Reach modding goal is slapped. It's crushed. It's absolutely annihilated. Dude, I will say as just like a complete side note here. I am, in fact, getting flashbacks to the maid stream, okay? Being here is scary. This place, this mod, this is where the maid stream happened. And I, I just, I don't know. I don't know if I can handle that. But thank you very much for that tip. You said, how much do I have to donate to get a tiny little model of mine in Extinction Map? I don't even think you have to donate. I can just throw it in there, dude. You ain't gotta, you ain't gotta do that. But... Actually, not, not really any butts on that. It's just, uh, it'll just happen much later. Big butt. Look at these squares, dude. I'm so good at this. My talent is incredible. Proud to be, proud to be an American right now. I go get model and DM it to you. I hope it's optimized. I can't believe I missed that maid stream. I can't either. I was waiting for y'all. I was like, I can't believe Big Wojo isn't here right now. I'm not talking about big butts. My mom is in the room. Big butts. What are you talking? Who's talking about big butts? It ain't me. I could be. Kind of want to be now because I like big butts, but it is it is not me i can i can actually confirm i'm not talking about them not yet give me time wait is optimized i made it for roblox the model limit is 1k vertices what it's 1k vertices limited roblox there's got to be a way around that there's no way
Boom! Uh, triangulate. Look at that, dude. Roof done. Simple geometry. Flat roofs are boring. I'm aware. However, I also do not care in this moment. Because I just want this map to be playable. And I'm not a 3D artist. Alright, let's do select, select edge, select edge loop. What? No, not edge loop. Uh, select boundary loop, mark sharp. Oh, wait, first shade flat. And then mark sharp. Select boundary loop. Mark sharps. What the fuck? Oh. What is happening? You know what? I honestly don't even care. I hate working with Reach assets so much. Does anyone else also, any Halo Reachers, just hate working with Reach assets more than anything maybe in the whole wide world? They're just the worst. There's always like broken shit all over them and nothing works right and it makes you just want to scream. It's 109.99. What are you what are you guys talking about? Fake it until you make it, yeah. Your walk animation for your huge grass cutscene project proves that you do get got some junk in the trunk. That's true. My ass do be fat. You're so right. Uh, there's a lot of people who are jealous of my dump truck. Understandably so. Makes you wish for a halo reach around. I really hate that, but it did make me laugh, so you have that going. Ooh. Gah. Well, we got the roof on, so that's pretty cool. Are my rocks and the hangar hidden? I'm turning on the hangar, it really killed my frame rate. Skaboodly, stop making high quality stuff. You bitch. How dare you make a high quality asset like that? Man, I just realized exporting this map is going to take like a thousand years. Can I even export this on stream? Maybe I should just do the space mod until I get the hang of this again. This is wild. I feel like I couldn't make a single change to this map without it just like exploding everything. Well, I guess I give it a try. Fuck it. Uh, I do need to UV all this stuff though. If you look, the textures are hilariously cursed. And man, I'm gonna be honest, UVing is so boring. I want to do something a little bit more entertaining than that. Let's see what the vehicles are looking like on Extinction right now before I get into some boring map stuff. Because the vehicles are a lot more interesting. I did kind of forget to do. Where is it? Beam rifle! Yes! Okay, the custom weapons are here. Uh, machete, that's there. H2A, SMG. Dude, I have to say the H2A SMG is very cool and I like that I added this. The animations are a little bit messy to be honest, but it's all right. It's not that all right actually. I'm gonna have to redo this entire thing from the ground up, but the beam rifle works pretty good. I'm triggered. I'm triggered. All of my Halo Reach stuff is so unpolished. Dude. I feel... Can you import custom sound files? Oh yeah. I feel this powerful urge to like nuke this map, dude. I'm gonna be so honest. I'm not gonna do it. But my instincts are just like looking at this and feeling disgusted just by how unpolished and messy it is. I just need to relax. I need to chill out. I think the main issue I'm having right now is... As much as I love all of Skaboodly's work, having his stuff on here, which I didn't make, like, triggers this, like, tiz inside of me that makes me feel like I no longer understand what the hell's going on in my own map. It's not anything against him in specific, it's just me not 
having made an asset on the map. I'm just like, oh, like it freaks me out not knowing every little detail about it. It's like, oh god, if something breaks, I might not know the reason for it. Dude, how did my Hornet break? The animations for turning sideways randomly decided to break. The forward animations work great, but the sideways ones do not. I have no idea why. Isn't the Extinction Pelican really polished? Um... It's not really polished, but it's definitely polished. I think it has destruction. It has basic destruction. Not like polished destruction, basic destruction, for sure. Oh, here, let's just break it in the Hornet. Shouldn't take too long. Yeah, see, we got it's got like markers and stuff, so it's not bad. Fun fact: we figured out how to pilot the custom, uh, Pelican and Custom Games browser in Reach. Yeah, I saw that. It's really cool. It's so cool that three four three added the vehicles to the. Uh, oh yeah, that's right. It does have decent destruction. Whoa! Holy shit! Demon. <laughs> this name demo of music or something. Thank you so much for sixty dollars. That's ridiculous, bro. You are you definitely did not have to do that. Thank you so much. What the hell? That's crazy. What the fuck? Thank you so much. Did your reach stuff looks unpolished because you kept ditching it for Halo Three? Oh, that's beautiful. For Halo Three, also, any if anyone else donates, I will personally drag their soul to hell. Nice. One sixty nine sixty nine. Nice. Cantaloupe figured out how to bypass seat restrictions with game type scripts. Phantoms works too. Wait, there were seat restrictions? Dude, I know nothing about game type scripting. That is like a complete blind spot for me in modding. I can do anything with map scripting and and assets and tags and stuff. The stuff that you actually need to download from the workshop for. But when it comes to stuff like Halo Reach game modes, I don't know shit. So I think that's really cool. That's really, really cool. I didn't know there was like a... That's really useful because one thing I want to do is bypass like, well, I guess I don't need to bypass it on modded maps, but I want to do like drivable scarabs using game mode scripting. I mean, drivable scarabs would go pretty hard. By the way, Demon, thank you again for the 60. That's insane. Also, yeah, nobody can tip for the rest of the stream. Please do not tip. We are right now at 169.69 and that is beautiful. Dude, this is what the Halo... This is what the Halo Reach Pelican should have been like, in my opinion. You look up and down, and the wings, like, rotate appropriately, right? And because Halo Reach was taking heavy inspiration from classic Halo CE, it also should have had this, where when you go forward, the wings go up a little bit, and when you stop, they go down a little bit, just like in Halo CE. And a little bit of that Halo 2 love by making it go like that when you go backwards, just because it looks cool, all right? I'm just, I'm just saying, I think this is like... I think the Halo Reach Pelican should have been a little bit nicer in that way. Instead, it was just like the Halo 3 Pelican where the wings only turned. That's it. We see. I. It seems like you have a lot of knowledge and like you're a, a big part of the Halo Reach like modding and scripting community. You have like a lot of like knowledge on this lore. So I would love to pick your brain sometime and like learn about it because that is like a huge blind spot for me. I, I missed out for like the longest time on that Halo Reach um, amount on a lot of Halo Reach stuff. People could tip Jar Dono, but either 50 or 60, 50 or 100? Would that work? Oh, it would. Your DMs when you get a chance, but I have to go. All right, let me see real quick. Let's see what it is. But Okay, I'll take a look at this. Thank you for sending it. Thank you, thank you. Alright. Let's get some good work done. Let's get some good fucking work done. We got trees, rocks, ships, structures. I can export all of these. It's all one BSB, including the hangar, somehow. I've warmed to the forward tilt. Good, good. Unfortunately, our most knowledgeable guy left the community, GG. Damn. 
Yeah, send me the Discord if you don't mind, Weezy. If you if you could just send that to me, like either my Discord or through DMs. Um, I am no stranger to like reverse engineering scripting stuff. So, if there's just people who left behind really powerful and interesting scripts, I mean, I'm not like probably any more talented than the next person, but like, even if these smart people are gone, just having their knowledge written out is really useful. How mesmerizing. Um. Um. Sparrowhawks looking spicy. Pelicans looking good. Condor is looking very good. <laughs> hey, that's me, apparently. I have... I, I tipped $2 to myself? Thank you, me. Oh, I ruined the tip goal. God damn it. It looked so nice at 169. Did you really know some things straight elongated eels do indeed dingus the hard internal shipping? D-R-K-S-T... Dark Steel. Did... This. Dark Steel did this. Ah, it took me a minute. God damn it. If that sentence actually made sense, it would have taken me a while to figure that one out. But it was nonsense. Dark Steel did this. Figured it out. Stroke moment. Listen, I, I, I figured it out, okay? Oh my god. Everyone's like, oh, sex is the best feeling thing in the world, and I will admit, it's pretty awesome, but this? I don't know, man. That tier list is getting pretty sus. Yeah! Let's go! I bet he'd love if I just made him some food and gave him a blowjob after work. Get out of the way, women. I have a fucking Mac cannon mounted on the back of my Condor to fire. Go away! Time the drag soul to hell. True, Darksteel actually just added themselves in the message. Yum. All right, I do want to get another playtest going on this ASAP. Remember to bake lighting so you can use the good skybox. No, we're not using it skybox, we're using this skybox. Also, I don't think I can bake lighting because the map is so cursed and has so much cursed geometry, things like this in it, where I booleaned it. Um, yeah, I need to delete these and just like rebuild them or something. They're from a skybox and they're just an absolute mess. There's just a lot of really messy geometry. Like the interior here is not stitched into the ship at all and I need to like make it its own complete object and stuff. There's all kinds of errors everywhere that are just causing the map to refuse to light bake. Is that from the original map? I think so. It's from the skybox if I'm not mistaken. Oh, my kitty, stop trying to bite me. I'm trying to move and get comfortable, and I'm trying to keep you in my lap at the same time. All right, I'm doing this for you. Don't get mad at me. Yeah, we got these new kittens uh, that my roommate's fostering. I'm trying to help with. Ever since they came in, my cat has not left my side. I think she's getting jealous that I'm spending time with these, like, little bean-sized kittens that are, like, two weeks old. She doesn't like them, and now she's, like, not leaving my side. She's getting very jealous. You're so sweet, girl. You're so sweet. Yes, you are. The best. I, I kind of want to go steal one of the bean-sized cats and show them on camera because they're adorable. They're so cute. All right, uh, let's get some proper, proper, real, for real, for real work done. Uh, one of the first things I need to do uh, is clear out like 99% of the objects and things in here. Including Godzilla. No, I'm gonna keep Godzilla, actually. Godzilla can stay. I'm gonna try to make a desert bus uh, map on those. Might look into it myself at some point since we can play out of bounds now. What? That's cool as fuck. Oh, sweet girl, you're so cute. You're so cute.
You're just like unable to get comfortable today, aren't you? You know, I need to put like a blanket in my lap so that you can be comfy. I don't have any small blankets. All my blankets are huge. 100 plus 1 equals 1,001. Actually real. See, most people are too afraid to say the truth, but Luke is saying it and telling it how it is. I respect that. Not everybody can do that. Why don't you want to use the Unearthed Skybox? Because I said so, Glitchy, all right? Because I'm a little bit different than all the other boys, okay? I don't want the Unearthed Skybox. Yeah, I said it. Freaking said it. Why am I driving the mammoth? Oh, what the fuck was I doing? Hmm. Oh, I remember there was a bug where nobody could get in the mat cannon because I didn't have its uh, bounding box set right. Hold up, let's fix that. Can I see its bounding box here? No, I don't think I can. I think I fixed it in game. I don't know if I fixed it in Gorilla. ADHD stream? Oh no, for real. I, it's like an unstoppable ADHD extravaganza today. It's awesome though. It's my favorite thing. There's just so many things I want to do to this map that I, I'm i just, like, overwhelmed. I'm, like, genuinely overwhelmed right now. I'm trying to figure it all out. I think I, I, think I want to sculpt some stuff. So I want to sculpt some new stuff into the map. Let's hide, like... Hide the rocks. Where's the rocks? Are they hidden? Let's hide the rocks. Go away. Uh, dude, I really love these bridge pieces, but they are cursed. They are completely... And utterly cursed in game. Like, look, let me turn on. Oh, I didn't mean to open that. I didn't. I didn't mean to open that. Look how cursed they are. I'm gonna like debug. Oh wait, I lied. They're actually completely fine. What? I'm the problem. This whole time, I'm the problem. All this stuff is really cursed. Like, it's a fucking rainbow extravaganza of issues in here. Holy shit. No wonder light's not baking. Joe, thank you for the $2 tip. Much appreciated. Unearthed Skybox also made the map look like dog, dog shit. Did I not? I remember going through a few Skyboxes and the Unearthed turned the map into a light bulb. I, I don't remember. Honestly, I have no idea. I did not know. I think it did though. If I recall correctly, it did, and it looked kind of cool, but it was just way too bright, and I liked the darker atmosphere more of this. Demon with the tenor, thank you very much for that, dude. I, I do genuinely appreciate that a lot. Thank you. Did you know there's a default add-on to VR chat called Audio Link? Demon. Demon. Demon, I have been making VR chat avatars since 2017, and I am friends with many very popular avatar creators. I have known about Audio Link for like four years. I know everything. All of it. All the things, except for like random obscure things, like new shaders and stuff that I'm always being told about by my avatar creating friends, which are very cool and very fancy. But yes, I, I'm very aware of Audio Link. I remember when it first came out and everybody was using it and freaking out about it. Don't show, wait, he said, sent you a fun vid, don't show on stream. It's kind of rude. Oh, you're actually making the, you're making the map, actually. Wait, this is kind of cool. Got a nice, like, uh, logo. Is this stuff audio linked up? Hold on, let me see this. This is fun. That it feels like a VR club, for sure. Where's the audio link, though? Oh, I see, it's on some of the shaders. Hey, good start. Keep that shit going. Keep that shit going. Unearth, uh, wait, I forgot how many errors this map had. Well, it's, the errors are really, okay, stuff like this is why the map has errors. They should be simple to fix. Problem is I'm, I'm shoving everything all into a single BSP right now. And most of this stuff, I'm gonna have to kill it. I also made some very rookie mistakes. I will admit, as much as I like to think I'm getting better all the time, oh, as much as I like to think I'm a good model, Holy fuck, I, I just can't speak.
As much as I like to think I'm a good modder, I'm always getting better. And one thing I know for sure is that I never should have dragged these assets into the map because they are breaking the map. Drink some water. I mean, okay. Halo 3 easier to mod? Much easier. Just all the reach map assets are really hard to utilize. Wait, these aren't pieces of instance geometry? What the fuck? Oh no, they are. They just... Yeah. My ears itchy. Because Halo 3 is beginner friendly, reaches superior, but did get some features from older engines. Yeah, Halo 3 is very... Well, Halo 3 is just simpler, to be honest. The tools, the blender tools are much better in Reach, but in Halo 3, uh, everything's just a lot simpler. Like, a lot simpler. Oi, no, my mouse goes there. You can't just sleep on my mouse pad on the side where my mouse goes. Good try, though. 10 minus 1 equals X. Uh, 9. X equals 9. Okay. That was a hard one. All right, I'm going to be honest. Took a lot of mental fortitude and, and brain power for me, but I did eventually figure that one out. Okay, I'm pretty proud of it. Okay, I'm gonna extract, I'm gonna put this in the game. I just wanna rem remind myself if this is doable, if it is doable for me to put this all in the game. So I turn on all the rocks and trees. What is natural? If that's rocks and trees, what the fuck is natural? Oh, it's just the other rocks. Manual rocks. A manual nature and then Nature. A pillar of autumn. I'm going to keep needs fix off. Gonna enable the portals. I think this is all good. All right, let's extract to an ass file. Nope. What am I doing? This is Halo Reach. We go export, and then it just does it. Rejected. Failed. What are you talking about? 10 minus 1 equals X. X is 9. What are you talking? What are you? They uh, just. Is this like the thing? It's it's this comic. Hold on. This is you guys right now in chat. I'm not pretending. <laughs> Shit. Oh, it crashed and burned. No! Why did it crash? Comic ruined. You're cringing me out. Please stop. Oh, wait. I know why this didn't work. Because it still needs fix. I don't want to... Do not include hidden... Can I change that? Do not quick export. Manual export. It auto doesn't export hidden stuff, right? Man, this is why I wish Green was around more. But he's all busy working on Unity stuff these days. What is crashing this? Also, why do I have so many goddamn portals? Holy shit, that's crazy. Is a chair that makes the mods the same chair as the one Jerome used to kill? Is the chair that makes the mods the same chair as the one Jerome used to kill that one flood? 
As far as I know, Jerome never interacted with... Wait, Jerome. Jerome. Am I going to have a stroke here? Who the fuck is Jerome? Oh, yeah, from Halo Wars. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It took me a second. All right, so here's the deal. I hate Extinction on a technical level. On a, on a complete technical level, this map is fucking vile. It's disgusting and it makes me sick. So I really just want to like delete everything that's not just terrain and reset because wow, it's so gross. I hate it. I'm going to delete the Pillar of Autumn. I'm going to delete the Hangar. I'm going to delete the Covey ship. Like it's all fucking disgusting, man. Uh, it's really grossing me out and, and nothing is going to work. I can't light the map. I can't, I can't do shit. It's really just awful. It's not good. It's a complete technical f dumpster fire. And uh, it really needs to be fixed. Drum killed some flood on, the, flood on the Spirit of Fire in between games. Man did it with a chair. Where, where is that? Is that in a book? Where did that happen? I'm so confused. Is this a comic thing? A book thing? Where do they talk about the spirit of fire between games? Is there a spirit of, a comic? Oh. Neat. I didn't know there was a comic. Yeah, I... Dude, this stuff sucks. Like, it's really good, but like, on a technical level, it just is ass. I think the main issue, the main ass part is the fact that this Covenant ship is so bad. Like, dude, just die. Just get out of here, dude. I, I hate this Covenant ship. I don't want anything to do with it. This, actually making this Covenant ship killed the fun of Extinction for me. I really hate it. It, like, actually, unironically killed Extinction for me. I'm going to bring back the main Covenant ship exterior. Um, it's real quick. Don't want to delete that. Just gonna hide it. I will delete all this though. I don't want any of this. Um, the Covenant ship interior idea, I'm totally scrapping it. I'm not gonna do that anymore. That has killed all the fun of the map and we will no longer have a Covenant ship interior. I, I just don't want it anymore. It's absolutely killed the fun. Are you gonna keep the big gaping hole? Yeah, probably. Um... I don't know how I'm gonna switch it up, but yeah, if it's if it's killing the fun of the map for me, that's a problem. I'm just gonna straight remove it, like it can suck my nuts. Maybe now it'll export. Return of the Covenant box. I don't know. I might just do the Covenant uh, base as like an outside base of some kind. Just how the original Extinction had it, you know? Or maybe I'll make it like a big destroyed interior space in there. I just really can't deal with it anymore. It's it's a lot. It's a lot, man. Alright, let's see. Uh, creating meshes from face properties. Mesh has no attribute. Use auto smooth. Oh, this is the same error as before. Um, I have to update the toolkit. Halo. Uh, what is it? Halo Blender. Boundary Blender Toolkit. Um, where is the... Is there not like a nightly build of this? I can't use Foundry right now with the new Blender. Where's the nightly build?
the fuck? Can I not mod Reach right now? Without downgrading my Blender version? Where's the... Where the fuck are the nightly builds? Two branches, maybe it's in a different branch? Oh, it's in the dev branch, okay, that's why. Updated six <laughs> hours ago, much better. Okay, let's download that. Sorry, I hear that, give me one second. Uh, download, zip, there we go, much better, much better. Um, Joe, thank you very much for the $2 tip. Really appreciate it. Thank you, thank you. He said, honestly, just rip the interior from the Long Night of Souls mission and give it a more destroyed feel with fire and shit. Also, which build of Foundry? Do you mean the dev branch? Yeah, I just, I was having trouble finding the dev branch because it's been so long since I downloaded it. I wasn't sure how it was sorted. But yeah, it was just a regular old dev branch. Um, not a bad idea. Well, actually, that's a lie. Long Night of Souls doesn't have an interior for that ship, so it wouldn't work at all. But I, I suppose I could... Not a bad idea by any means. Definitely could work. But it wouldn't be useful really because it wouldn't have any space for drop ships. So it would just be like kind of there. Uh, Demon, thanks for the five. Appreciate it. All right, you were mentioning a YouTube short. Sent you a link. Wait, really? You mentioned me in a YouTube short, huh? What I miss about the. What is this? What is this? The old halos. The UI, working theater, metal designs. I really miss the saw. Easily 343's best addition to the game. I miss the sticky detonator. The saw just made you feel badass like other power weapons couldn't. I mean, sure, a sniper takes skill and a rocket is fun, but there's nothing like mowing a player down with a lot of bullets. Yeah, honestly, I'd just take getting the SMGs back. <sighs> I guess I'll just keep dreaming. Uh, I think Rejected Shotgun found one of the files. Oh, fuck yes! And... That's me! I'm Rejected Shotgun! That's me! Yes! I did, in fact. It was in the files. But it was a leftover from Halo 5. It wasn't really in the game. It was just a leftover. You're actually Green Knight? It's true! I am Green Knight! I am! I am! Okay, let's just go to a new fucking thingy. Edit, preferences, uh, actually... Hold on, you guys need to stare at the video game for a second while I fix uh, Foundry Blender Toolkit in the background. It's the IO Foundry scene. This has Foundry Dev. Get you IO Scene Foundry with resources zip. IO Scene Foundry, go here. There it is. Drag that. Okay. Compress to zip file. Make this foundry dev. Grab you. Put you there. Okay. No. Foundry dev. Plug in. There we go. Okay. Now I got it. Took me a minute, but I got it. Foundry. So disable, remove it. Then I want to install the new one. Now it's in. There we go. Boundaries up to date. Use tool fast. Default scene matrix is Blender. Get managed blam in here. Where's my directory? Does it not have a directory selector in here anymore? Projects. Extinction. No wait, that's the extinction main folder. This is the extinction export folder. Maybe Deadhead? Is that a project that I can add? Yes! Omaha! Okay, very nice. So if that's Omaha... Manage Blam Dependency not installed. Please install it in the main Foundry panel. I think I might. Install Tag API. 
scales and rotates the blender scene. Wait, that's so cool! Dude, this new update's amazing! Oh wow, this is so good. It's been so long since I updated Foundry. No way, this is amazing. Could you do a Godzilla minus one boss in Halo 3? Yes, in fact I was messing around with that already on the destroyable city I was doing the other day. Which was pretty good. Pretty freaking good. Well, now that I set that up, I can open up my extinction and extract this into the video game. Let's see if it works. Oh, that was way faster. If he wanted a H2A jokes to end, he'd just scroll up. What? Tell Drake I said I'm an awesome Helldiver song. Is it copyright free? It's loud. This is literally like fucking... What does this sound like? I am getting massive Dragon Force vibes from this. Like, can you show us the mammoth? I sure can. Must have gotten accustomed to H2A jokes by now. Accustomed? No, I'm not accustomed to H2A jokes. I'll have you know. I think they're dead. I think... It, literally, you guys uh, come into my stream and you're like, H2A, it's been like over a year, dude. This is my least favorite... Alright, I'm just gonna... I'm actually just gonna fucking rag on you guys so hard for a second, okay? I am actually gonna call you out so fucking hard right now. It is... It, you know what? Like, you'll be in a friend group and you're like talking to people and you like make a joke and end this kind of like the in-joke for like a couple weeks. You know, you've got your little in-joke, ah, I said the thing, and then the joke just kind of fades out and it loses its charm because like you've heard it so many times, the joke's just not funny anymore. You guys like are incapable of realizing that reality with the H2A joke, dude. It's driving me nuts. You guys have literally taken what was like a funny little silly bit and you have just like, mil you, you've kicked in, you have milked that joke for way too long. It stopped being funny like over a year ago and then you just keep going. Do you know what happens when somebody tells a joke that is no longer funny? It is cringe. That is what happens, okay? I'm not gonna sugarcoat it. It's cringe when you tell the same joke over and over. I'm sorry, okay? It just, that's, it is what it is. I don't make the rules, I just abide by them. Okay? If you keep telling the same joke for a year straight and nobody laughs, you have a problem. I'm sorry. I'm not really that sorry. I'm pretty tired of it. Like, just fucking get a new joke. Please, dude. Please. You're like a comedy cemetery like 95% of the time. Please. Do better. For me. I mean, for all this H2A talk, there's also no notable H2A mods yet. Yeah, I mean, I don't even care. Discussion about H2A, totally fine. But the, the, the fucking quote-unquote joke is... Oh my god, dude. I, I just can't. I just can't live like this. I can't fucking... I can't live like this. I didn't even import it. Created tag. Oh, it's not done yet. Okay. I was like, wow, the interior to the ship is... That's crazy. 
H2A has become unfunny. It has been unfunny for fucking a year. You guys never listen to me. You're like, haha, we're making Rejected mad. And I'm like, dude, you guys just have like no awareness of the fact that it's not funny. How are you still talking about this? It's crazy. You have like no social awareness at all to realize that it's just genuinely, unironically, not funny. I, I don't get it. It's just, what the fuck? We can make, you can, it's okay. And that's okay. It can be not funny. You can just make a new joke. We can just have a new one. We can just, we can just make new jokes, guys. That's the beauty of humor. It could be made of anything. Anything could become funny. We can do better than just fucking H2A. Please. For the longest time. We, you guys have just had one joke. It's like you're incapable of making other things funny. What the fuck? Figure it out. in the mammoth cabin oh i didn't i didn't do it i gotta give credit where credit is due it's uh uh who it was bruin the mammoth guy bruin did a um an interior for the mammoth I'm not getting mad, Gun Bear. I'm going mad. Now, Bruin opened up this interior for the Mammoth. It made a nice little interior space for it, which I have not given as much care as I probably should have. But yeah, you can go inside the Mammoth interior now, and it's pretty cool. It's pretty, pretty cool. Although, the collision is still messed up. I gotta fix that so you can kill the fucking driver in here. Or no, it was the physics model that was causing the issue. But I should probably fix the collision, too. Bruin, the mammoth guy, made that, and I just, uh, I attached it to the mammoth and gave it physics. Alright, so you've been insane the entire time, we're just not helping. Alright, let's see, Darksteel, thank you for the fiver, I appreciate it. Uh, you said Green Knight moved his project from H2A to Halo 4 due to missing <laughs> libraries. So, not even Green's mods H2A anymore. I got you ranting about H2A one last time. You, you ain't got me doing shit. You got me calling your ass out. This is not a W for you. You don't, you're not taking a W. You're not like, oh, I got a rejected to rant about it. I am calling your ass out. That's what's happening here, okay? You can't just spin this around and be like, oh, I took the, I got rejected. Got him one more. No, it was not funny. It hasn't been funny for a year, okay? You're being called out. Joe, thank you for the $2 tip. I appreciate it. Thank you much. Okay, back to extinction. I'm gonna cheese from all these max. God damn it! That's so that that is cheesy. Uh, that was a bad joke. Although Halo Wars 2 Mac is so good, I know it's so fucking good. We need to, we need a Condor moment. We need a Condor moment with that Mac cannon. It's so good. I need to just like place it. We're gonna fly this Condor and we're gonna activate its Mac. Uh, he said, "All uh, I love it. Too bad it was the worst Uber unit in that game. It is a bit sad. I will admit." Yeah, Abyss, I'm gonna be honest, I also agree. I feel bad because it's my community, but like, supporter chat has actually become not fun. It is, it has become, it is an annoyance. Alright, I'm sorry. Nothing, I mean, there's actually, there's some cool stuff that gets posted. I will say, um, there is some cool stuff in supporter chat. For example. Where is it? Scrolling. There's some cool mod stuff that gets posted in supporter chat, like people making cool stuff, which is nice. And when I stream, there's actual discussion in supporter chat, but like, then people just start shit posting really dumb stuff in there. Mithrandir with the 12 months. Thank you very, very much. I appreciate it. He said, it's okay to come up with new jokes, guys. Real, real. That is on their 12 month badge. They threw out that message saying, it's okay to come up with new jokes, guys. And they're fucking right. You ain't gotta be afraid to come up with new jokes. Yo, Skaboodly! Now that I understand how this map geo works, we could make this map way more detailed. My basic process is manually creating seams and portals with booleans. It's cleaner. 
Yeah, it is. It's a lot cleaner and it works really nicely. Like I thought it would cause a lot more issues, but it does just work kind of. Well, for the most part. Anthony LaMonica with 23 months already. Holy shit. The first 24 month is coming up. That's going to be wild. That's actually going to be crazy. Can you make a giant turret into a vehicle? Anthony, I have good news. I mean, modding real reach is painful. It really is. It's worth it. Like you can make some really cool stuff and the atmosphere of reach is awesome, but it is a bit painful. And honestly, Skaboodle, you're right. Like I did not do an amazing job on this map, Geo. It's okay. It's passable, but it's not amazing. And I do want to do better on it, to be honest. I really do. Halo 3 is easier. I know. It, it, Halo 3 is a lot easier. Are you able to make the dinghy in Halo 3 a vehicle? I actually have already. <laughs> Fuck it, I'm gonna open up huge grass in the background really quick for the dinghy vehicle. I can't not. Like, you guys have to understand, the dinghy is very powerful. Just open it in the background, alright? Just, just let it cook. Probably talked a total of two times. Listen. Just fight, just fight to the death. Grab some swords and shields. Words are weak. Real power comes from knightly duty. Leaning portals and seems by hand is actually more reliable than the seam splitter tool does. Forget marking planes as portals. Yeah. I mean, you get more out of it. And it, it causes them to be really clean, like really clean, which is nice. I should do that more. I've been booleaning more stuff lately. I always thought booleaning was just like really messy, and it can be if you do it wrong. But yeah, it's nice. Halo 3 is insanely tedious compared to Foundation now. All this map geo is fine, honestly. We just have the tech to really up the detail with cliffs and such. Well, the main problem is just getting all the errors out, okay? This is where it goes from being like, yeah, you can do stuff the dirty way, but you have to clean it up. Things can't be, you can't have your geometry unclean. Like, look at what a disaster this map is right now. This side of the map's not too bad. There's only a couple errors, and the, t the terrain is fine, because I, I was expecting it. But, like, doing render models in the map is a fucking nightmare. Render models into map geo requires so much cleanup, it's... Oh, God, it's horrifying. I just... I can't do this. I literally cannot do this. And then, like, these are actual map geometry pieces, but... Porting them over has caused massive errors, and I basically need to rebuild them from the ground up, and it's 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 so scary. So yeah, long story short, wait, did this crash? It did crash. Point solution, crash. Pillar of Autumn, thirty-one. Oh my god, this shit again. You crashed it? Really? And we're, you know what? I'm gonna deal with all that later. I'm gonna rebuild Extinction off camera at some point. And that's gonna be awesome. And for now, I'm gonna keep it simple with some fucking asteroids and a space mod, man. I can't. I can't, man. I just can't. And you're going back to these old mods that are absolutely cursed and horrible. It's crazy. I'm giving a talk tomorrow about my career in the game industry and use some of the tools and process. I'm going to teaching some youngers how to do game dev. That's sick, dude. What the fuck? That's so cool. I hope somebody, I hope you like record it. That'd be really cool to see. Let's do a space mod. That's exactly what we're doing. Exactly that. Hey, weasel. You look cute. Yes, you do. Teacherly doodle. Yeah. Introduce yourself back. Like, hey. I'm, uh, I'm Teacherly Doodle. I'm here to teach you things. Got dinghy in there. Did that finish loading? It did. It most definitely did. Removed from the map. Unacceptable. That needs to be on the map at all times.
Look at that beauty. Just something special, ain't it? Look at that. Hey, we're ready to go. Let's get out there on the water. Joe with the $2 tip. Thank you very much, man. I appreciate it. Okay. Our YouTube dono is mega delayed for audio to come through on the stream. Stream is quick as fuck, and the YouTube one was like five minutes. Yeah, I don't know. YouTube uh, donos sometimes get really delayed. The tips in the description are like almost instant every single time. But yeah, YouTube super chats, they will appear on the chat instantly. But as far as like integration, it's like really slow. I don't know why. And honestly, it doesn't matter too much because I'm going to be switching to stream elements soon anyway. But yeah, here we go. This is the dinghy you've been waiting for. Also, in general, read the YouTube dono. Thank you for the two! Question in supporter chat. Top image, best one. Top image, best one. Oh, you're talking about the difference in extinction between the two skyboxes. Let's see. Which one of these look better? I actually wholeheartedly believe if you had to pick between these two, this version of extinction where it's very bright, and this version of Extinction, where it's very dark and gloomy, I think the dark and gloom is way better. And this is back when the lighting was baked, too, so it actually, like, looks good. I think this was also with baked lighting, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, you can, it is. Yeah, that is much nicer. In my opinion. That's way better. Alright, you've got your fix of dinghy. Yes, we will save a uh, huge grass with the dinghy on it. And now we've got beautiful, beautiful Halo Reach space mod. God damn! I love it. I fucking love it so much. I feel horribly misunderstood now. For the record, I didn't mean the Tyrant A turret. I was talking about the Helix A turret on the pillar bottom. Oh! Yeah, I think I did have plans to do that at some point, but I probably won't end up doing that because it'll just become a useless vehicle that somebody will just spawn camp with and it won't be fun or add to the gameplay in a meaningful way other than annoyance. But it would be cool in a fun sense, like a technical sense. Just to just have it. Alright, space mod do be needing some work though. I will I will fully admit to the fact that it is really behind schedule. Oh god, I might actually die here. This is not good. Oh no, you don't. Nice, dude. Fuck the covenant. Uh, another cool sweet image and supporter chat from Adiri? Uh, from, uh, from... Yeah, you said Adiri. Let's see. Ooh, dude, these... This looks so cool. This actually is gonna be so sick. The real arc. Oh, I can see how it's, like, in motion. Do that motion blur. This is so sick. Those of you guys who don't know, um, Adiri around here is making some incredibly cinematic, like, blur level models for the Covenant ships, and it looks really fucking sick. And they're doing, like, their own giant arc 3D model, which is just really nice. So, seeing somebody do, like, cinematic space battle combat with their own models and their own skill is just really, really fucking cool. It's badass. Are you making the whole cutscene? I would love to see that. Truly, that would be so sick. I'm looking forward to it. Okay. So there's, if, we, if we want to do a play test, by the way, let's just to, to circle back to the space mod. To do a play test, um, there are two things that are missing currently. One is uh, a game mode that spawns us into these ships, and two is choosing and deciding a lineup of ships for the first play test, and then like refining those specific ships. The scripting, yeah. I mean, it should be a really simple game mode. It's literally Team Slayer, but then it has like a random generator of like picking 
what ships to spawn in. And then having, you know, spawn points for when you spawn in. I guess there's actually a third thing as well, which is an actual map. You know, a map that you can go around in. And, like, have cover. I think one thing I really want to do... You see this big old ship over here? I want to make the destroyed Long Night of Solace, like the same one that I have on Extinction, but like floating as debris in the map that you kind of have to like go around. I think that'd be really cool. What if eight infinity ships? No thanks. I'm good. <laughs> That's a lot. Um, Quick maths. How big is the infinity compared to the Covenant's biggest like CCS ship? CCS class cruising. Let's do the maths on it. Halo... Wiki Infinity Halo Wiki CCS class. All right, CCS class battle cruiser. Or am I thinking of CSS? I think I'm thinking of C. C. Isn't that the big one, the CCS class? Length is five thousand eight hundred feet for a C. Oh, CCS class is the cruiser. The Covenant capital ship. I don't want the battle cruiser. Dude, what is the big show? CAS, or is it CSO or CAS? Uh, let's just go with yes on both of those. So yeah, that one is 5,300 meters for a CAS assault carrier, but for the super carrier, it is 95,000 feet long. Holy shit. Alexander, thank you so much for the nine months of continued support. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Appreciate it. The space mod returns, and with it, the request for Project Stardust Game Night. Oh my god, that was so long in the past, I forgot about it. As well as bribing with copious amounts of Oreo balls and whoopie pies. I will say, I have been craving Oreo balls lately. I had some, I had made some like a year ago, and I haven't had them since, and I've been really craving them. Thank you for your continued support. Isn't the Infinity just the same size as the average Cubby carrier? Nothing makes, nothing that makes the Infinity special, as I recall, is the fact that it runs on 400 tech, which gives it giga shields and weapons? Yeah, which somehow were taken down by the Banished. Don't know how, but that's crazy. Um, but the good news, something very cool is happening. The CSO class supercarrier is... Let's find out. How big, how big is it? How much, time, how much bigger is it than the uh, Infinity? It is... 19 times the size of the Infinity. Grabbing some balls. Let's go. All right, so 19 times the size of the infinity is how big the super carrier needs to be. That's ridiculous. I don't know if I can even fit this like in the in the mod. This is gonna look insane. I and mean, I'm gonna try, regardless. But this is gonna be insane. Wait, do I have rocks in the Anchor 9 thing? Oh, fine. Ugh, okay. So I'm gonna quickly do something. Hold on, let me append. Okay, cool. We're gonna append, uh... We're gonna append the infinity in here. This bad boy. Wait, what? Is this the entire map? That's not right. Oh, this is the actual Halo 4 Infinity, that's why. Whoopsies. Um, we're gonna append... The... Spaceship's new Infinity. Source. Textures. New. Okay, never mind. I lied. We're just... Not... Gonna do that. Infinity 2, maybe? There it is, the Malfinity. This is the correct size. Okay. So 95 times that scale is going to be the size of the actual... Wait, is your math not mathing? Or you got numbers? 19 times? It's only 30 kilometers? Ah, but the CSO class supercarrier in length is... Oh wait, it's 28 kilometers, which is 95,000 feet. No, I think that is right. Hold on. 
And then this is... Yeah. No, it's 5,000 meters, not feet. Whoops. 18,000 feet. You're right. I messed up my units. Can't we all just use the metric system? Please! Please! Now, what I meant... What I had intended for is... Kilometers, which is tw uh, 30 kilometers versus uh, 5.6 kilometers or 5.7 kilometers. So 30 divided by 5.6, which makes it about 5.3 times bigger in total. So now what I need to do is hide that. I'm going to try, keyword try, grabbing the stuff from Extinction. Let's see if that's even going to be possible, but it should be. I'm looking here. Maybe, maybe. Where's the Covenant stuff, dude? Rocks. Platform. Oh, here. L L o S destroy. Might already be at the correct scale, to be honest. I think they are. Is this actually to scale? I would say that's roughly five times bigger. Well, let's just, like, get this sized up, you know? Okay, and then uh, we'll, I'll, I'll grab the actual big big ship as well. I think I, I should have one ripped from the game. Where are you? It should be under, yeah, super carrier. If I'm not mistaken, this is the full-sized super carrier. Did it really import into here? It did. Oh, and it imported with no model. How cool. The super carrier. Turn the pieces angle down toward the planet and make them over time slowly flow down and out of the map. Um. Object machine, I suppose. I don't know of any good way to do that where it actually syncs over multiplayer properly. Unfortunately. Okay, this is the full-sized one. Why are you going into the Anchor 9 collection? Go into this collection. Fuck's sake. Oh my god, it's still in there. I'm gonna... <laughs> Sad days worth a shot. I mean, I agree that it would be very cool, and Skaboodly also had an idea for a long time of, like, having these um, asteroids just kind of floating around and stuff, which, admittedly, very cool idea. I like it. The problem that comes to my mind is... Mostly... Oh, wait, hold on. The I just remembered something. The infinity is... Wait, where is the infinity? Hello? Where did the infinity go? The infinity's gone. Hello? Where the fuck did the infinity go?
Oh, it's under Anchor 9. Of course it is. <sighs> what is that? Oh, at least that pulls it out of Anchor 9. Oh my god! Darkbolt, thank you so much for the two. Appreciate it. Thank you, thank you. Abyss is hosting game night down to join. Um, not really, to be honest. This, just I just don't feel like playing games tonight. I just want to mod and do stuff. To be honest, I'm kind of angry, and if I play any video games right now, I'll just become like a fucking rage monster, and it won't be very cool. Nobody will laugh. They'll be like, that was weird. Rejected's being fucking crazy today. That's kind of scary. Alexander, thank you so much for the five. Appreciate it. Thank you, thank you. I've donated at least 200 plus dollars around wanting Project Stardust game night for ideas for Space Mod. I'm not just going to let you forget and take my money. What do you mean? You're willingly giving it to me. I didn't for I didn't hold you at gunpoint. And I've told you each and every time the same thing. I probably won't do it. I've never lied to you. Although I did say we might do it actually at one point, admittedly. Self-admittedly, I did say we might do it. Boom, proper scale. That's kind of toxic. I don't know which side you're thinking. I hope I'm not coming off as toxic for that. I just like. Oh, I just have this thing. I just have this thing that I do. You know, where people like tell me to do something and I'm just like, oh, I'm never going to do it now. It's crazy. The infinity can just fit in the missing chunk of the super carrier. It is very crazy, admittedly. But the scaling is all kind of wacky and wild. Very, very much wacky and wild as far as scaling goes, but I'm curious to see how this will look. Almost kind of, I almost want to remove this ship from here, but we'll see. We'll see how this looks. Archer does have a point. He's not obligated to play Bobux. Uh, yeah. Archer, I'm currently telling you to get jiggy with it on streams. I, I'm not going to pretend like I don't very greatly appreciate uh, you sending in those super chats, Alexander. I do. I truly, I do. But I, I'm not just going to do a thing because you tell me that it's your birthday and because you throw money at me. Oh no, it crashed again? Uh... Let's see, if I remove these... Oh wait, these aren't... No, these are instance geometry. Let me save, save that, delete these two, and see if it crashes again, then it's an issue with just reach exporting in general, which is very possible. Please, just work, please. 
Please. How do you change skyboxes in a map? Oh, that's actually pretty simple. I can show you that while this loads. Uh, what you do is you go in uh, the editor here, uh, Gorilla, or I guess it's Foundation for Reach, and you go Levels, Multi, um, let's do Forge World, I guess. Then you go into the Scenario tag. The Scenario tag is like literally the level tag. Honestly, I love watching a non show who doesn't give any pressure and does what they want. Let's not forget our entertainment here started with uh, this giga chat in a dream. I feel like it gives me a lot too much credit. Like, I definitely, if somebody sends me a shit ton of money sometimes, I'll be like, okay, I'll give in, you know. Like, fuck it. You know, whatever. I don't know. But I try not to do that because I, I do think it's pretty lame for me to do that. Sick. I need to change the skybox here, by the way. It's literally a scenery object. Right there near the top of the scenario. Under the skies area. The more you know. The double-edged sword considering we pay him for mods and he sells that at a game night for Ultimate Forge. I mean, I would hope you don't pay me for mods, to be honest, because that ain't how it works. Ideally... Oh, it is crashing, dude. Ah, that's so lame. That means I have to... Get another version of Blender just for doing Reach right now. Uh, oh no. That sucks, dude. That actually sucks. Alright, let's get an older version of Blender downloaded. Blender download. Let's do Blender 3 point something. Do a long term, long term support version. Let's do 3.6 LTS. Really? 3.6 LTS takes this long to download? Alright, we're gonna be here for a minute. We're gonna be chatting. Let's, let's fly this thing in chat while my old version of Blender downloads. Zoom in. Wait, which one of the ships has a glassing beam on it? It's not this one. I, put the, oh, I think I put the glassing beam on the destroyer, if I'm not mistaken. Maybe I removed it. Oh, I did, damn it. All the Covenant ships have the same loadout, which is pretty lame. I can do way better than that. That's so lame. Max, thanks for the fiber. <laughs> Appreciate it. Love you, baby. Thank you so much. Okay, love you too, sweet cheeks. Thank you. Remember, do not update Blender, let it auto-update. I, I never do, but recently I switched to the Steam version. Not recently, I did it like a year ago. For, I don't remember why. I should never have done it. But yeah, I switched to the Steam version, and now it auto-updates. Can I make it not auto-update? Always keep this game only... There's no auto-update? On, there's no not auto update. Oh wow, that actually upsets me. I wish Streamlabs would let you donate one cent, then I'd donate more. I mean, I think it does. No, I don't think it does actually. <laughs> I'm sure a lot of people would uh, donate a lot more if it with the one cent was the minimum. Ow. My only. Point is after the last year of making my own content, I realized a lot of things about this profession. And the quickest thing I found was that most people on here shill out for cash. Uh, I just want quality. Yeah, I mean, shilling out for cash is very lame, and people shouldn't do it. I've definitely done it. I'm not free from guilt. Ow, what the? Oh, I died, dude. What the fuck? I actually died. Copy ship needs some dedicated to fire beams. Uh, there is a major issue with beams in this mod. There's a major, major issue. It's very sad. Beams will never work properly in this mod. They have a maximum engine limit. I cannot make a beam that goes across space. You have to be very close to a ship to use a beam. 
I'd say sending this man money is not a direct purchase, but more like a gas in the tank of a machine that makes random cool mods. That is a very good way of putting it, to be honest. It's like supporting me to make more Halo modding content of just like random shit. I am a modding machine, and uh, YouTube support is gas in that machine, that is true. And hopefully you guys won't even have to worry about that as I finish my video I'm working on, hopefully tonight, and then go forward making a, a giga, gigaton of, of just money through sponsors and things, and you guys never have to worry about sending me a tip ever again. I was ranked two on donos in Streamlabs. I must have sent a lot of $2 donos. You do send a lot of $2 donos. That, that does add up over time. Oh wait, why am I on this? I want to be on the Spirit of Fire. Oh, I forgot how cool the Spirit of Fire is. Oh my god, I completely forgot. Easy. Those are archer missiles, I know. Go we'll port the top of the Spirit of Fire map from Halo Wars as a multiplayer map. That would be pretty cool. Even though I'm selecting a different skybox for the to the Spirit Mission and Foundation, it never changes in Sapien. Are you sure you're editing the right scenario? Because if you save in, in Gorilla, it'll it'll instantly make a change in saving. You're probably not editing the right thing if that's the case. Or you're not saving or something. Maybe those AI ships would be in the mob when it's out. Uh, they... They can be. This was originally a multiplayer mod as a, as a plan. Ugh. Sorry. I'm going... I think I might go snag some food uh, downstairs really quick. I am, like, uh, quite tired today. Actually, you know what? I'm going to get myself some coffee and grab a snack while it's brewing. Give me, um, give me like, two minutes, you guys. I'll be right back. Um, I just want some fuel, some actual fuel in the tank for making these mods. Less motivational fuel, actual fuel. It keeps me going. I'll be back in, uh, give me, like, three minutes. Enjoy. Enjoy your chair time, you freaks. You monsters. You absolute creatures.
I'm back! Nothing better than calming music to be completely interrupted by a loud, obnoxious guy. <laughs> yeah. Oh, the coffee. Oh, the coffee! That's bringing me back to life, dude. I'm gonna be so honest. I was like slowly melting. I was like, oh man. My body's getting a little hard. My brain's kind of like, it's just kind of drained. Wait, what is that? We got... Is that what I think it is? Craze gifted five memberships while I was gone. Thank you so much. Craze, that's really awesome. You can snipe Loki, Nerved Up, Micah, Aether, and Cap. Let's go. I appreciate it. And B with the five dollars. B. B. Thank you for the five said time for Halo. Right. And then... <clears throat> Exploded. Dark Steel with the two. Thank you for that, by the way, B. I appreciate you. Thank you, Dark Steel, for the two. As well, I said, check supporter chat. Okay. Why won't it work? All right, let's see. We're going to analyze what is inevitably a skill issue. First, we see Foundation loaded up on the mission M35. And then we see Sapien loaded up once again. The mission M35. Yo! Craze with another five gifted! Thank you so much! I appreciate it. Thank you, thank you. You weren't here, so there's more? Well, thank you very much. You technically gifted five to the chair before. We don't talk about the chair here. Not a very good or nice guy. But thank you very much. Hokey Pokey Snipes, Silex, Mighty Robin, Sun, Sun Goku, real Sun Goku, and Iggy. Let's go. Rejected. Where's my special fart surprise? I'm sorry, what? Probably on Deviant Art, to be honest. That seems like it's right up your alley. Chair farts? I, I'm gonna be honest. Actually, I was gonna say I don't fart in this chair, but I do. I definitely do. I just, I'm just not a big farter, to be honest. You know, I'm just not a gassy guy. I've got a very healthy gut. It's just, yes, you do own it. I really just don't, not that much. Like a little bit every once in a while, you know, just to be real. But like, nah. Just, I'm just not gassy. Though I will say my my roommate did make this bean this bean soup the other day, and I'm not gonna lie, that changed that changed everything <laughs> for like two days. Completely different story. It was not good. It was not good, dude. I and mean, it was tasty, but everything else after that was not tasty. All right, let's see what's going on here. Skies, you're replacing this guy. Wrong post? What are you talking about? What? Stop spamming. This is not it? No, what do you, you mean wrong post? This, I was responding to this. Okay. Read the actual ping from Dark Steel. But I was responding to Glitchy. What do you mean? You're, okay, you're so dumb for this. You're saying wrong post and I was just reading a completely different separate post. I was responding to Glitchy. I can do multiple things. Darksteel pings you? I'm not just gonna respond to the ping. I was also help- I was helping you! Like, bitch, what? Darksteel was the dono? Oh, check- Oh, you mean because I read the supporter- Yeah, yeah, the thing that got me to supporter chat in the first place? Okay, sure, sure, sure. Sure. Betas. There's a beta for... Oh, Blender has all of its versions in the beta branch. Oh! I would like to enter a beta. Can I please get that 3.6 stable LTS, please, and thank you. Update that shit. All right, I appreciate that. I do. I do appreciate that. Chair stream has really gotten to us. It has. Y'all are insane. You need help. Get some help. We are going to save Space Castle. Get some help. You're scaring me. You can have Blender on Steam? You can. I would not recommend it. Though I will say... It, I should have said, oh, it's cool. Yeah, actually, it gives you a usage time. You can see how long you've used it. But according to this, I've only used Blender for 13 hours. That is a fucking lie. I have used this for like a thousand hours on Steam alone. And many more thousands off of Steam. 
Joe! Thank you very much for the $2 tip. I appreciate it. And you know, I will say, for everybody after Demon who left us at 169.69 on the daily reach modding goal, you have not killed the 69 cents, and I respect you all very much for that. Um, and thank you, Joe, for the $2 tip. You said Sun Goku got a membership. Not gonna lie, that was my alt. Dude, I fucking knew it. I knew it. I remember Sun Goku, that account, sent a thing in, like, your style the other day. And when I read it, it literally, I thought it was an alt, and I knew it. He said, I forgot to delete it. I kind of should have deleted it before I got gifted, but I literally haven't touched it. Why I gifted? Was it in the stream? It must have been in the stream. Ethan, with the $10 tip, too. Thank you so much for that. You guys are crazy with the tips today. I really do appreciate it. Thank you so much. So cheers to making mods. You inspired me to get into Halo modding and occasionally work on them since it can be quite relaxing. Dude, I am so, so happy to hear that. That's fucking awesome. He said, now I have, I somehow have the 11th most popular Halo 2 mod on the Steam Workshop. That's so sick. Wait, what's your mod? I, I, I would love to see it. He said, by the way, withdrawal uh, is annoying, but finish the fight. Thank you. I appreciate it. This helps. This little fake fume thing actually helps a little bit. Well, that's so awesome. I will say this. Um, it is never my like purposeful intention to motivate anyone to get into Halo modding, but hearing that just like any content that I've made or done has encouraged you to do Halo modding is fucking awesome. I my I will say I do hope that seeing me doing Halo modding lets you know that like fucking anybody can do this stuff. Cause I'm gonna be honest, I'm like a very like fucking average like me median human being. So if I can do it, anybody can do it. I love how the stream came to life after getting coffee. I do have a crippling caffeine addiction. I have no idea what you're talking about, dude. I have no idea. Listen, it's because also I'm withdrawing, all right? Still, uh, my withdrawals, I think, are probably going to happen for like many months because I was so deeply addicted. But yeah, the, the caffeine helps. I do have a caffeine addiction, probably. Definitely. Who am I kidding? So, you know, it helps. It really brings me back. Cat got Spartan mod when, though? You know, the first... Is it the first Reddit post on my on my Reddit account? Hold on, let me. I'm gonna go to my Reddit account. Hold up. Can I sort by like oldest Reddit post? Oh, whoops. I'm gonna go to my Reddit account real quick. Sort by. Can I like do reverse? How do I like go all the way back? I need to fucking scroll like a million years into the past. Okay, I scrolled. Apparently I did not post very much on Reddit. Oh yeah, here it is. Four years ago. Four years ago. I posted this on Reddit. Nice. Nice. Oh my god, she's got unbelievable cake. Oh my god! Jesus Christ! Brush shaders? Yeah, I don't know. I was fucking around with the shaders at the time. I don't really I don't really remember what was going on with it. Uh hell, I'm missing super chats though. Damon, thank you very much for the two. I appreciate that. You said I'm taking all their souls talent. Good. But they're helping me, you know? They're like they're supporting me as a YouTuber. And Halo mod or so, you know, yeah, maybe maybe like the cool ones, you keep them away. Um, and Wrath with 19 months, that's insane. Thank you. He said, what sort of space mod shenanigans have you done? I'm trying to get a giant super carrier in here, and I actually should be able to if Blender, yes, we're on version 3.6 of Blender. So it means I can actually extract and export my map now. I'm adding really cool, gigantic pieces of um, map geo into the map here. Which is really awesome. I love you, Weasel. Uh, go chase her, go get her! Which is really awesome, because that uh, basically makes this mod a lot more viable in general. It's the space game equivalent of terrain cover and just cover in general, because right now there's none and it's really scary. There used to be a lot. Demon has done some massive donos before? No, Demon has. Demon has done some crazy donos, but most, actually, I think Demon's biggest dono probably ended up being from gifted memberships, if I had to guess, like in a single stream. Because memberships are kind of expensive. I think it's like $3 per membership or something like that. And he's dropped like hundreds before, which is insane. 
I will say there was one time when Halo Infinite was like very first released. It was like Christmas after Halo Infinite dropped and I was in campaign doing mods on stream. And it was like like around Christmas or New Year and like legitimately people, I got like multiple $500 super chats, which was like the craziest fucking thing to me. It's actually just so wild. I think that was probably the biggest uh, dono stream I ever had. Did I read your last dono? I don't know if I did. Um... You, you didn't dono after that. There was no suit. There was no tip. Oh, wait. Yeah, no, you're right. You're right. You, you tipped uh, $2. Thank you very much. You said, never touch that alt since uh, that one dono from it. It wasn't in the stream. The system is just that bad. You should learn from Twitch or just not suck ass. That's so weird. I wonder why it would target that account of all things if it's not even in the stream or logged in anywhere. What the fuck? Demon lives in a cardboard box. Dude, Demon lives on like a fucking gilded throne. Like gold, red, black. No, gold's a little bit gaudy. I don't think Demon would like gold. It's probably like silver if he was going to use a shiny accent. Or maybe shiny black. Shiny red? I don't really know, to be honest. I think he's more of like a shiny black and red type with some like white in there, but like matte white. Demon single-handedly paying reject with rent. I hate when people say that. When people are like, demon single-handedly paying reject with rent because people are just like... Y'all, the math does not math on that one. I appreciate Demon, and he is fucking awesome for sending in like fivers and stuff and chatting. But if you really do the math, that, 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 that do not add up. Also, my favorite color is nowhere near red. Blue. It's blue. The opposite of red. Okay, we're going to pin... What version of Blender is this? That's just gone now. I'm going to unpin that. We're going to pin this new one. Wait, what? Huh? It saved 3.6 as a separate... Okay, cool. I still have the old version with all of its stuff, I guess. And it imp Oh my god. Wait, this is actually fucking sick. This is so sick. Dude. I take everything I said back about about the the blender on steam it's the best way to do it blender on steam is the best way to do it hands down this is sick you can have multiple versions all with separate add-ons and stuff it turns out all my old versions of blender before they updated are all still stored in their immaculate version in fact the version of blender i'm on right now i can literally see what i was using right before blender updated and i was doing the Pelican damage states for the Halo Reach Pelican here uh, on Extinction. Although now I think I am probably able to work on Extinction again. Let's see though, because I need to hold back. No, 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 no. There we go. Halo Reach editing kit. Maps, Space Castle. Why am I appending? No, open. Okay. Wait, what? Where did my big ship go? Big ship! Where's my big ship? Oh, I'm stinking mad. I should learn how to animate. You should. Animation's really fun. What are we listening to? Call of Duty Black Ops music. Animation is awesome, and you should absolutely absolutely learn how to animate you will not regret it all right we're gonna we're gonna import those ships again first one we're gonna import is infinity 2 we'll get our malfinity in here full scale malfinity well okay mini scale but who cares we're not going to stress the details then we need the super carrier um which looks like that and then we're going to actually append from the extinction map, which is going to have our destroyed pieces that are all cleaned up a little bit. Admittedly, while I did import just the giant ship debris, you know, it, it is a little bit cleaned up. All right, 
there they are. And uh, we're gonna have to scale this appropriately. So first things first, we'll bring that down to size. So that, my infinity is a little undersized, so about there would be more appropriate to the infinity's actual size. So from that, we'll do scale 5.3, which is the math from the wiki that says that this is the actual size this is supposed to be. So now, I can take these. And, uh, you know. And scale them to the right size. Like so. And the same thing here, but you know, gotta fix all the rotations. I think that's good. And I can scale that properly. A little too big, actually. Actually, a little bit too big. Demon, thank you for the fiver. Appreciate it. Since you're ignoring my chats that aren't super. Oh my bad. I didn't know. I didn't notice. I'm ignoring everyone's chats, so it makes it any better. Probably not. But uh, uh, my favorite color is that, which is nowhere near what my jester wears. That's your favorite color. I'm gonna have to put that into a little hex hex code website real quick. Hex color codes. HTML color codes. Your favorite color is not available on this website. Hold on. Oh. Hey, this is actually one of my favorite colors. Although I will say I prefer a slightly less saturated and slightly lighter version of this color. This is, uh, this is Demon's favorite color. For all you guys who are wanted to know what that color code looked like. It's a very, very dark aqua. And I would say my favorite color is a bit more... Like that. Close, but not quite. This kind of pale blue. That's it right there. That's the good stuff. Not quite. I, I wouldn't say it's the exact text code, but it's close to this. I swear to God, what? What did Joe say? Give it a bit more green and call it vomit. <laughs> That's funny, dude. That's funny. Steven's like deeply offended. He's like, this motherfucker. See, that's pretty cool. All right, I want to try exporting this now. Now it should export without any issue. We're on 3.6 Blender, uh, my old 3.6 that has all the old add-ons and stuff. Oh no, Demon Sway he needs to put the change in Shotgun's tip jar. Wait, what? No, don't put any change in the tip jar. It's at 0.69. There is objectively no better tip amount than for it to end in 0.69 cents. Okay, 0.42 cents, not as good as 0.6, it's good, but it's not as good as 0.69 cents, okay? Please do not enter a cent amount. Thank you. This is your public service announcement. Are these instance geo? Oh god, I can't check. I hope they're instance geo, <laughs> I have no idea. Oh, I disabled the sky, it's gonna explode. Oh god, it's not gonna import properly. You can't tell me what to do, old man. I, but I am. But I am right now. What about 42069? I mean, that would be pretty cool, but nobody's about to drop fucking 230 bucks. That's way too much money. Actually, don't. Do not do that, in fact. <laughs> Just say the sky went supernova. I guess that's fine. Well, in fact, we're actually going to be able to see a supernova in the night sky, uh, in the, most likely in the upcoming next weeks, few weeks. Actually, it's not a supernova, it's a regular nova. 
And uh, it'll be, it'll basically just look like another star in the night sky. Which is pretty cool. So it should be about as bright as one of the planets. You should be able to see it like in the evening and, and uh, as soon as the sun sets. I don't know if we'll be able to see it in the US. I know in Canada you can see it. You know, as you know, you know, the Earth do be tilting over the years, so we might not get a clear view of it depending on the Super Zero Nova. Yeah, most people don't even know that Novas are a regular thing. It's not just supernovas. Can we have space combat over extinction? How do you know? How do you know we don't already have that? Hmm? How do you know extinction's not right there? Hmm? Extinction could be under that cloud. It's, it's the right color. That could be that little blob right there, actually. Canon, this is a canon event. That is extinction right there. It's literally right there. So, there you go. Oh, you bitch! Marty Gamer tipped $3.79. First of all, thank you for supporting me. Second of all, suck my schmeat and my schnutz for putting the 79 cents in there. We had a we were chilling at 0.69 for a long time. That's rare. People are always here to fuck it up. I should I actually just should have not said anything. Because that, that inevitably somebody heard me say that and was like, oh, 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 okay, buddy. Like, I, I really should not have said anything. <laughs> I am angry. Cheeseburger. Real. You're actually very real for that. Also, that's true, and you're true, and that's real, and it's true. Dude, I just had to go silent there while I did that because that was just fucking sex. Like I, like I said earlier, people are like, oh, sex is really cool. And like I said, you know, it is. Sex is cool. But have you tried being the pilot of the spirit of fire while firing onto a Covenant cruiser over reach while it's being glassed? Probably fucking not, okay? And I'm going to be honest, it's great. It's awesome. It's very, very awesome. No complaints here. Is the spirit of fire came the spirit of water? No. It is in fact the spirit of fire. That's the spirit of fire? It is. It do be it do be the spirit of fire. Does I actually get pretty cool meeting black flag vibes? Good. Good. That's what I like to hear. Ugh. <laughs> Hey! Wait, well, slight A. First of all, Modded Gamer, thank you for the 279. Appreciate that tip. And also for pushing us over 200, which is crazy, dude. Actually crazy. Genuinely, like, balances out all the, like, shit streams I've had lately doing content that nobody wants to see. But thank you very much for that. He said, a second for good luck. Also, this still isn't stream elements. Gah. I mean, you're right, and I'm disappointed in myself for that. Might have to keep tipping this way until you switch. I, mean, I guess that's better than just not at all. Now we're at 200.27. You could have added it up to an even 200. I'm just throwing that out there. But instead, you had to add the 20. You had to get it. But thank you. I appreciate it. How is this thing taking damage? Honestly. How has it taken damage? I genuinely don't know. That's wild. Alright. Uh, let's see what happened with Blender. Did we crash? No, it actually... Oh, no, it did crash, but it crashed because of a reason I expected and totally forgot about. I didn't have the sky on. There was no sky on the map. Okay, let's try again, but this time we'll actually export things properly. And I won't make a, a noob mistake by turning off the actual map. Wait, the extreme... Who, who is the bean cult? How am I the streamer of this community and I don't know about the cult that started in my community and then became toxic? How is that even possible? 
Can somebody explain the lore on this that I somehow missed? Or this isn't, it's two years ago, so this is not. You actively attempted to ignore their crap? Well, that explains why I don't remember anything about it. Can we get more unique weapons for different ships? Yeah, that's the, the biggest thing that the Covenant needs. <laughs> Gordon Ramsay rejected his cooking fine. <laughs> got bad enough that you had to green purge them. I I don't think I remember. <laughs> it's true. I was the cult leader. <laughs> no, I don't remember now. I'm sure that I, I would remember if I like saw something about it. But yeah, I just I totally forgot. Oh, it's going to work this time. It's going to freaking work. Oh, it's going to work. Oh, it's going to work. Wow. I'm losing my mind, dude. I'm fucking losing my mind. It's Taco Bot! Dude, my roommate's in the chat! That's crazy! Taco Bot's here! Real Taco Bot! No way! I'm gonna head out and play some of your daddy mods. <laughs> yeah, have fun with it. Have it good. Go do your, enjoy. Have some fun. Play video game. Good video, good play. Video game good. Good play. Thanks for being here. I appreciate it. And thank you for the gifts and subs as well. Have a wonderful rest of your night, Craze. I think it goes faster if I shake the window. Sure is taking a sweet time. <laughs> really. You call me a name, I am not. No free tacos for you today. Free tacos for everyone else. What? But that is, wait, I crashed again? Importing structure space castle thief. Oh, you know what? I didn't even, what the fuck was that, fuck was that noise? Yeah, oh, these were set as structure. They need to be instances. That'll that'll fuck it up real good. That'll do it. Let's try that again. But this time, we once again do it right. <laughs> yeah, that's no brew. Absolutely no brew. Free tacos for even Green Knight. What? That's crazy. Senor, what is new with it? Uh... Not a whole lot yet. I'm trying to get my my workflow for reach back in action, but it do not be very happy with me at this particular moment. Unfortunately, but it will be happy with me once I get it all working. Um, I'm trying to get it ready for gameplay right now. I've added, as you can probably see here, a giant destroyed uh, C. It was like C O S E S O uh, super carrier onto the map. Lore accurate. Si oh, fuck. I forgot to destroy. I forgot to delete this thing right here, and that's probably going to cause it to crash. I'm an idiot. Answer me, or I'm calling the Twitter police. What are you asking? How do you know we call you? Reject the shotgun's roommate, Taco Bot. That's a, I mean, to be fair, like Taco Bot can, can know things. Taco Bot can in fact know things. I gotta leave, there's some modded bot 2000 guy doing some ghost hunting video game event on Phasmo. Also, I'm just thirsty right now and getting a drink. Wow, I, did, I wouldn't call him a drink, but it's good to know you're drinking him. Yeah, have fun there with him. Taco Bot could be my roommate, free tacos every night. True! 
Dude, actually, Taco Bot's deeply offended. Taco Bot is like, I literally cannot believe that you guys are just like turning the tables on me and calling me somebody I'm not. Taco Bot works hard out here. Taco Bot is out here doing what other people refuse to do. What do they get for all their hard work? They are forced into a box. A roommate-shaped box. Man, fuck Taco Bot. In the best way possible. <laughs> nice sunglasses, gamer. Spreading the goodness of tacos. Yeah, and can you say that about yourself? Are you spreading the goodness of tacos? Take your time. Think on it a little bit. Hmm? Maybe just think about that a little bit. You probably won't, because you're not. Why am I waiting on this when I know it's going to crash because I <laughs> fucked it up? Whoa! Taco Bot 2 with the $2 tip! Thank you very much. I appreciate it. Taco fact. Hot tubs make tacos soggy. Wait. I am not a hot tub streamer. Taco prophecy. If you make a taco mod, the taco ban will be lifted. How did you know I was going to get in the hot tub tonight? How did you know that? Who told you that I'm getting in the hot tub tonight? I only told my roommate. How did you know that? Only my roommate would know that, Taco Bot. I, and even now, I'm getting a little bit suspect. A wise second bot of tacos, please. I beseech thee. When tacos are not forthcoming, are fajitas or burritos the superior alternative? I don't know. But listen, Taco Bot, okay? I'm I think You know, there's there's the old saying, and by saying I mean the law. Innocent until proven guilty. Can you prove your innocence? Which is backwards of the saying I just said, but don't think too deeply on it. All right, I'm just gonna pilot the UNSC Infinity and kill everybody. I mean, that's how the Romans did it. Burden of proof rested on the accused party. Oh, no, no tacos for you today. That's it? Damn it. They actually owned me there. I'm like one of those, they owned me like I was just some damn liberal. Like I don't Talk about really just said, facts don't care about your feelings, then slapped me. Slide me across the face. All right. For the map imports, come on, come on. One shot, one opportunity. Do not miss your chance to blow this opportunity. Come to the oh! Right time, yo. You hyped me up, it's working! It's not- wait, I lied, it's not working. Oh! Oh, so, oh! They're so small- guys, look at this. I brought laser beam. It's laser beam. Look at this. Oh, they're so tiny, I love them so much. Hey chat, look! They're so sad and useless. It's a hamster! Only two weeks old. We call it laser beam because it likes to scream laser beam sounds. Yeah, it doesn't do like the high pitched ee noise when it meows. It goes pew, 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 pew. I gave it to uh, Weasel for a second without her realizing what it was. And he's like, oh, what's that? Sniff, sniff, and start hissing. <laughs> ran away. It's so cute. The cat is Taco Bot. It has it's been Taco Bot this whole time. You're so tiny and sad drums. and useless. Tiny it's so scared. Oh. I don't know when to name them, but look how cute. 
They're so cute. I fucking love them so much. They're just, just tiny and useless, and they're the best things ever. They're being bottle fed every three hours. I still have the other kittens too. Um, only four of them though. The others had to go back to the shelter. So I have four big kitties and three small kitties. Such cute gato. El gato! You can put it in my pouch. Return to the pouch, cute kitty. No, it's crawling on me. It's, you're so cute. I'm sorry, laser beam. Literally a kangaroo pouch. That's so adorable. They're so fucking cute. Alright, bye guys. <laughs> 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 Oh, because they're kittens, it's Gatito. I didn't know that. I I crashed it again. I can't export a single reach map today, dude. I not even one single reach map is able to be extracted today. Can I can I do it if I like don't do the long night of solace? Like can I just not do reach maps today? Is it I'm like, yeah, I'm, I'm about to do Halo Reach maps today, and the, I'm gonna finally do it. Everyone's gonna be so happy, and then the fucking blender's just like, no, you're not. No, you're fucking not. You're not gonna do any of that shit, are you? I'm just like, what? But but I waited so long to to work on Halo Reach stuff. I'm finally gonna... No, you're fucking not. Don't even think about it. Change your goddamn... Go back to Halo 3 right now. Think about what you did wrong. And I'm like, but I just wanted to mod Reach. Everyone, myself included, wanted... No. Turn around. Forget about this day. Taco fact. Cats are only based if they eat tacos. These cats would for sure eat tacos. I'm going to be honest. They they are the type. They are 100% the type to eat tacos. Can you help with why Sapien is being annoying with the skyboxes? Uh, I mean, it's very simple. It is very, very simple. All right. I will, I will help you with this while the map exports. All right. I'm going to open up M35 myself. Levels solo M35 dot scenario, right? I'm gonna open that up, then I go over here. Levels solo M35. Scenario. Tip idea rejected us to wear a cat costume and eat a taco. I'm actually okay with that. I'm gonna be honest. I'm actually weirdly okay with that as a tip idea. It's a lot better than the maid costume, in my opinion. Maybe for maybe I should do a tip goal where it's like cat gun stream, where like I finally just do the cat gun, but I have to dress up in like a cat onesie while I do a big black cat onesie. All right, let's see what's going on with the skies here, Glitchy. We got one sky here, which is M35 sky daytime. Okay, sure, that's fine. Uh, so. I'm gonna let the I'm gonna let the mission load and then do it. Just the cat ears in a supreme grunt trap. Yes, hell yes. That that sounds like an awesome stream, dude. All I have to do is put on cat ears and eat a crunch wrap supreme. Like, bro, sign me up. I'll do that right now. You don't even have to tip me for that. That just sounds great. I start the stream about guys, please. Can we get a one dollar tip? I really want to eat this crunch wrap supreme, please, guys. Please, oh, we're in okay. Let's see if we can do something about this skybox glitchy. So we got we got M35, very beautiful map. Love this map. Got a really cool water shader, to be honest. I actually really like that. I fuck with this water shader. Did I wish so badly to turn this into like an actual map? This outside area. The outside of Tip of the Spear is so fucking cool. There's like a giant dam with water, and then like you have all these scarab battles going on down here. Like this would be a cooler version of Extinction, to be honest. Like it's just more interesting and inspired. Like, truly it is. Like, it's so cool down here. Like, there's so much detail. For what? Like, actually, just for what? Why is there so much detail? This is awesome. And, like, the, the idea of, like, you have this, like, river, this big <laughs> rivery canyon, and then, like, this big hillside full of stuff onto a dam? Like, that's so cool. Modded Gamer, thank you for the $2.79. Much appreciated. Really? You're gonna do the two... 
Okay, we have a we're at point zero six cents. Nice. Uh, thank you very much for that tip, though. You said it's ghost hunting time. Take another fun tip for good luck. Well, I appreciate that. Thank you very much. Two seventy nine is like an even ish amount. You know, that's how much I'd pay for like a bagel or something. So that's that's better, I suppose. But yeah, yeah. It's all right. Appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you much. Much appreciated. Thank you. Very kind of you. Oh, you can go all the way down here. No wonder they put in so much effort on this cliff face. Oh my god. This is the spire area. Dude, I didn't realize how big this mission is. Look how fucking huge. Can I load all zone sets at once? Can I do all? Or will it crash? Oh, I don't think I can do all here. Damn it. That's a, such a shame. Blah, 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 blah. I could probably make a zone so that has everything rendered. But yeah, look at like how big this map is, right? This is where the cutscene happens over here. This is where the giant battle occurs. And then your warthog drives over here. The bridge blows out just like your back. And then you come driving down here. And then you do a bunch of stuff there. And then you do stuff there. And then you come all the way over here. And then you go all the way over there. And then you're all the way over here. Like this map is huge. What is that? That was a box. I saw that. What was that? Alright, so anyway, changing the skybox. Cat is literally the worst driver ever. Yeah, no, that's that's true. That is absolutely true. Alright, so let's change the skybox. We go here. Let's do levels solo M30. Sky Knight. Save. Switch. Hmm, no dice. It actually didn't change the skybox for some reason. Is the tag, like, referenced somewhere else or something? Maybe this is actually the same mission? No, because the skybox should be different. Let's see. <laughs> Whoa! God damn! Oh, shit! That's what the fuck I'm talking about, dude. Thank you, holy shit, that's a big one. Thank you for the, t Nick, for the $24.94, basically $25 tip, that's huge. Much, much appreciate. I really can't tell you how much appreciate. appreciate. Thank you, thank you, thank you. So here you go for the Crunchwrap Supreme, my dude. Cat ears are optional, but highly suggested. Fuck! I actually do want to get a Crunchwrap Supreme now. You're making this very difficult. Now I have to get a Crunchwrap Supreme, when I could have just not gotten a Crunchwrap Supreme. Damn it. Damn it. Damn it. Thank you very much. I appreciate it. And for evening it out. Can we just take a moment to appreciate Nick for evening out the tip goal? Because that did not have to be. That did not have to be done. But it was done. Alright, here's what I'm going to do. MO5. No, I'm going to do like fucking M10. Sky. Sky morning overcast. Okay, we're going to do that and see if that fixes it. Now you can feed yourself. I can. Though it is a bit of a waste of money to order it on stream, which so I, uh, it makes me not really want to do it that badly, but maybe I could. Say fuck it. Modded Gamer with a two... Oh, you bitch! You're such a shithead for that. Thank you for the 279. I appreciate the money and your support. I say no to your perfect tip. <laughs> That's what you sound like to me right now. Insane. Dickhole. Just wanted... I just wanted... One of the, some one simple thing in life, you know, just one simple little, simple little thing, and apparently I can't have that. Okay. Structure BS. Why is the sky just like not? Scenery resource. Is it? Is this because it has a scenario resources block? New split resources. Maybe. I'm going to be honest. I have no idea. Here we have the sky reference resource right here. Maybe this is it. I don't know. Reach does some weird stuff. That's sky daytime. Which is the same thing as. Maybe this overwrites the actual sky block. Let's see. Try the sky night there. Oh yeah, that did it. Now it's nighttime. 
Yeah, so to answer your question, Glitchy, I have never done this on a campaign mission. I guess campaign missions are, like, really optimized out and everything. But the way that you're, quote-unquote, supposed to do it, I guess, is you go to this block here called Scenario Resources. And inside of it, you'll find new split resources. And then in there is Sky Reference Resource. And I guess this overwrites every other thing. Smash that like button. So true, Novaru. Dude, can we, can we, just because Novaru said so, can we get 100,000 likes on this live stream? Guys, I think we can do it. Can we get 100 million likes on this live stream? I think we can do it. Also, side note, Glitchy, if you're going to replace a skybox, you need to be aware that that is not everything that controls the sky, okay? There is far more to a map's lighting and atmosphere than just the skybox. I don't know if... Well, I mean, you mod. You, you know about, like, the atmosphere and stuff. Camera effects. Here. About these blocks. Here. Camera effects. Screen effects. Atmosphere parameter. Oh, you don't need those actually. Atmosphere globals. You only got the toolkit recently? Oh shit, okay. Well then, know about this area here in the editor. It's near the bottom. You should probably just search for it. Screen effects changes like bloom and stuff on your screen. Camera effects is pretty similar. It's like post-processing. Um, actually, where is fog on Halo Reach? Is it in the fog tag? Is it atmosphere globals? I don't remember. I don't know. Reach handles it in a way I totally forgot about, but it's definitely one of the tags that handles fog and lighting and stuff. Can confirm it is one of the many tags of all time. I'm scared. I'm scared that my roommate came into the chat because this is like, this is the time of night when she gets like bored. And she's like, oh my god, I can't believe he's still streaming. He's still doing his job. Ooh. <laughs> no. <laughs> I knew it. You're still here. <laughs> Don't blame waiting to end on me. <laughs> I don't want to end though, that's the thing. I want to make a big spaceship go boom. Nice, all right, we made it, we're in one piece. One piece. Okay, there's bad news though. I'm gonna be honest. I have no clue why this is not exporting. I'm kind of sad about it. Material properties collision. Oh wait, does it not have any face properties now? Oh dude, I love this. I love the fact that these things get named that every <sighs> Halo started out with ass files, dot ass files, and those are the missions. And each individual structure starting in Halo 2 onward that was not just the actual map was known as a poop. So you have the poop inside the ass. And then all the way to Halo Reach. We, uh, we get to this point where they have these little window objects, and they get named Poop Steamy Windows A. Dude, think about the years, like the 10 years of development that went from making a map format called Ass to finally naming something Poop Steamy Windows. That, that's just beautiful development right there. It took 10 plus years to get to Poop Steamy Windows. And I think that's beautiful.
Bungie has a good sense of humor. They did. Uh, okay, I'm a little bit sad and depressed right now. Maybe I will take my roommate's advice and end it really. I need to figure out why my reach maps aren't exporting at all, and I'm very sad about it. I want to get these things exported so I can actually make cool maps, but nothing is exporting even on this older version, and it's depressing the ever-loving hell out of me. I literally can't make any progress on these maps. It's annoying. I just want to have big ship debris and stuff going around. Here's what I'll do. Tonight, I'm gonna sort out why the hell I can't use my toolkit anymore for reach. I'm sure it's my problem. I'm sure I've done something really stupid. Don't know what that is yet, but I'm pretty certain of that. So, so that is definitely a thing. Um, I'm gonna call it quits for here, for now. Um, I'm gonna be modding reach, by the way, for the foreseeable future. Any Halo 3 stuff I'm gonna be doing is gonna be off stream for the next while. I am still gonna do Halo 3 stuff off stream, um, and so I'll be posting it like on Twitter and in supporter chat if you guys are interested at all But yeah, I I'm gonna call it quits for today. I, I apologize for it being a little shorter I just like guys I literally can't make progress until I figure out what the hell's going on and that's gonna be like the most boring thing ever So I apologize. That's a little bit lame of me, but I I did actually stream a little bit unprepared today I just didn't expect things to break But that always happens when I switch back to reach There's always some weird bug like this that I have to overcome and then I can start modding reach again I'm gonna remember this in case there's a the next time but yeah, thank you guys so much. I hope you're looking forward to some more Reach content. I'm back on the grind. The grind set. We're going to get Extinction 5.0. We're going to get Extinction 6.0. We're going to get Extinction 6.9. Think about that. That's amazing. And also the space mod. Maybe some other stuff. I might, I might just start up some wacky side Reach projects. That sounds fun. So, you know. I'll be like that. Halo male grind set. You're so right. We're sh you're so right. I, being a Halo male is not easy, let me tell you, but out here I'm doing what it takes. I'm doing the best that I can, and it, you know, it ain't easy, and it never has been, but you know, it will be. What am I reading? Wait, let Ethan fix the dono amount? Fine! I'll wait. For like... 30 seconds. You got 30 seconds. All right. This is that's it. 29, 28. I'm not going to count it all. It's a lot of effort, but you just know it's roughly 30 seconds. Or or I could just sit here for a while longer, to be honest. Wait, watch Ethan be like, wait, let me fix the dono amount. And then they just never do. <laughs> I'm just sitting here like. Halo Kitty Island Adventure mod win. I was just talking to my sister about this the other day because uh, when we were growing up, she had a bunch of Hello Kitty DVDs. It would actually go so hard to make a Hello Kitty mod in Halo. Okay, I'm jumping out of here. Thank you guys, by the way, for uh, an incredible stream. This uh, truly has made me very excited to get back into Reach. We will get some cool stuff done. I'd, I'm very motivated to work on Extinction again, but I'm going to have to do a major overhaul of the mod in order to be satisfied with it, and I'm very excited to work on the space mod again, um, but I need to actually get some, need to be able to export stuff to make the mod better, so we'll we'll see what's going on. Check Dams out of stream. Yes, sir. Alright. Um, I will see you guys tomorrow. Reach streams tomorrow. I'll see you then. Have a wonderful rest of your night, y'all. See you then. Bye-bye.